All right, whoa, hello everybody, and I just want to say hello to everyone, uh, those of you who's been uh, watching my live stream, and thank you so much, and uh, you know, I, anyway, I didn't plan to go live tonight, like I didn't plan for me to uh, do something tonight and li have a live stream, but it seems that I, I, I want to, it seems that I, I, I really want to share something today, because as I promised the other day that I was going to do a live stream, and I can't wait. I've been wanting to bring you this topic for a long time, guys. Like, I really wanted to bring this topic for a long time. And currently, apa ya, uh, pengen banget bawa topiknya ini. Tapi uh, dari dulu tuh gak ada kesempatannya untuk aku bawain. And to tell you the truth, uh, like, it has been... It has been a true a long time since i really wanted to share with you this topic tapi at the same time okay, th things is gonna be really 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 awesome this time around in this topic so i want to say thank you so much for those of you who's been actually oh yeah yeah just wondering kenapa my mic spike is so high untuk yang ada di sini but anyway i hope you guys are hearing me currently right now because um yes i i'm doing a live so here it is so so what's gonna happen is very simple all right guys so um for those of you who are new to the channel and you've watched you probably watching this uh, 10 o'clock tomorrow morning because i do know once you don't follow the live kalau kalian gak ada di live nya ini sekarang that means you're gonna watch this tomorrow uh, besok lah and i think tomorrow uh, at 10 o'clock and you'll be watching this for those of you this time around it's gonna be quite scary because i do know some of these board games that i'm about to share with you are the ones you probably seen yang kalian pernah lihat dan kalian mungkin main enggak tapi pernah tahu yang namanya banyak orang yang suka main so here it is so uh, today is gonna be really good and for those of you who haven't subscribed to my uh, youtube channel please do subscribe now and um and you know just I, I will give you a couple of seconds for you to subscribe subscribe now and i think uh, uh it'd, be, it'd be all good because you know why but analytics my analytics itu katanya ya dari 100% orang yang subscribe to aku 80% masih belum subscribe jadi mereka datang ke sini hanya nonton tapi mereka don't subscribe i know you like it and, and all that but you know it, it, it will do a really good thing to the channel and if you like the channel also it'll be really good also it doesn't help me it doesn't get me paid quite a, uh, anything anything at all but it just really helps the channel untuk channel ini very healthy all right so I, I can't wait to share with you this i've been wanting to share you this two weeks ago and sampai sekarang and i didn't have a chance for me to share so here it is you guys ready by the way if you're sleeping alone tonight you should not watch this stream kalau kalian tidur sendiri tonight and agak sedikit takut Go away from this stream now And you should just shut it off And watch um, the stream tomorrow at 10 o'clock But if you say you're brave enough And you want to take the challenge Stick around Because I'm going to get you spooked tonight And hopefully you get very very scared And I have a true life story Ada cerita yang benar-benar kejadian sama aku Di dalam yang namanya streamnya ini Alright, so before I start I'm gonna say hello to some of you inside the room I think Sharon ada di sini Hi, katanya Hi Sharon, how are you? How are you? Jason is here also Hello, katanya Hey Jason, hi Florencia ada di sini juga Yes, I'm not late this time Yes, you are not Flo You're, you're still inside Yeah, I just I just started the stream by the way Yeah. Darren juga kata Darren bilang crap <laughs> this again he's probably saying crap he's probably saying okay, damn this guy again you know um, well you know you click the channel I mean maksud aku you click the stream if you click the stream you you, you know you're, you're put up with the stories that I have and by the way all of my stories and my cerita malam are based on a true story so things that happen to me Florence Shep like I've been waiting for this horror, katanya. Stream about games and I'm happy I'm not late, katanya. Okay, uh, Sharon, you're good. Okay, that's very nice to know, Sharon, okay? Um, no, uh, you let me know. If any one of you want to talk to me in DM, you want to talk to me in the comment section, please do, because I'm always here to help you out. And if you need any advice, I'm always here also. All right, guys? So let's get started. Jason bilang kayak gini, Coach, uh, shout out to... Ah, katanya, Coach, shout out, uh, shout out to Favel. He sent me your stream. Nice, let me give a shout out to Favel. Favel, thank you so much for passing um, uh, my stream to Jason in, inside the room. So um, let's get ready, Jason, and I hope you guys strap up. Buckle up, sit down, get some popcorn, get some drinks, and cover up yourself with uh, slim wood, and turn off the light. <laughs> turn off the light, get your room dark, and just listen. If you want to see visual, I'll be here, but if you just turn off the, you know, if you just turn off the lights and put your phone down, just listen to me with your earphone or headphone, I think that's the way to do it, because I sure know, I sure do know that things is going to come your way. Dengar gak? Dengar gak? <laughs> okay, anyway, I don't get you scared. So let's get started, all right? So my topic today is three game boards that you don't want to play or you don't play at 
all three games board atau disebutnya bahasa Indonesia nya adalah yang namanya uh, tiga mainan yang tidak boleh dimainin by the way pas aku bilang tidak boleh guys I truly feel aku pengen kasih tahu sama kalian bener-bener ini tiga game ini nggak boleh dimainin no matter what you might be saying ntar in the future when I get you know when I grow older pas I get bigger I'm gonna you know I'm gonna really do something and I'm gonna I'm gonna test it out the games I should tell you now do not test these games about I'm about to tell you so disclaimer before I start my content here it is whatever I share to you whatever I, I information to you it's not for me to for you to test it out bukan kamu untuk kamu mencoba tapi di sini adalah untuk kalian preventif supaya kalian tidak melakukan ini in the future and because there's a lot of stories that happen amongst these games and amongst these board games and agak sedikit bahaya for me to let you know okay so let's get started here it is so my topic today is very simple tiga mainan angker yang dilarang main atau top ya ya title nya beda sih di dalam streamnya tapi nggak apa-apa it's almost the same juga tiga mainan angker yang dilarang main you know there's a lot of things that you know in this world that people game in some of us some of us play games some some of us play really wait let me see let me see i get a stream here hello guys <laughs> hey, say, say hello to my live stream. Hey, Coach Paris is here. <laughs> okay, Coach Paris is here. Anyway, he just called me just now. Uh, your phone call went through my computer just now. Tapi nggak apa-apa. I'll call you back, okay, guys? Let me finish the let me finish the live first. Okay, take care. Bye, bye, bye. All right, all right, guys. Uh, that's uh, that's really cool, right? There was some inception just now. He went to you guys went to see him, and he was in a iPhone and you know it's some kind of inception thing. Okay, anyway, let's get started. Okay, tiga mainan angker yang dilarang main. Ini bukan yang namanya jangan main atau hati-hati main. Bukan. Ini tiga mainan angker yang dilarang main. You shall not play this game. So I just want to let you know. Get ready for this. So let's get ready for the sw- for the first one. All right. So yang pertama, you guys know this. In fact, board yang pertama yang aku mau kasih tahu sama kalian adalah board ini sebetulnya udah lama banget di dalam dunia ini. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. And you guys know it. The first one. That's right. It's called the Ouija board. Sebetulnya aku sebutnya Ouija board, tapi in real life, true fact, fun fact adalah ini disebutnya uh, bukan Ouija, it's Ouija, Ouija board. Uh, pokoknya uh, pronunciation-nya beda lah. And sebetulnya this board has been around in the world for quite a long time. To tell you the truth, dulu in the 18th century, uh, ya yeah, mungkin a bit a bit earlier, In fact, this board was used not for for the sake of uh, calling ghosts or calling spirits for answer your questions. Gini ya, I let you know what this board mean. This board itu sebenarnya dari dulu adalah orang memakai boardnya ini untuk ngomong sama orang yang sudah tidak ada. Maksudnya yang sudah tidak ada. Mereka bawa or mereka bawa uh, arwahnya ini atau mereka bawa spiritsnya ini, and then they ask questions. The questions are, of course, it's never about the past but it's always about the future and people love to do this i have no idea why in america it's very famous this board very famous and boardnya ini you get to answer questions and if you can take a look at the board the board is based on okay the real board zaman dari zaman dulu adalah boardnya itu dari kayu by the way guys jadi kayu jadi selembaran kayu kayak gitu dan kayunya ini ditulis dengan alfabet jadi alfabetnya itu ada a sampai z and then abis itu ada 1 sampai 10 and then yang namanya boardnya ini ada yang namanya yes sama no so I'll repeat one more time ada alphabet and then ada 1 sampai 10 by the way you wouldn't want to do this okay trust me if one day in the future you might go hey this is what Ricky coach Ricky was talking about maybe I'll just test it out I, wa- I disclaimer to all of you whatever you do after you watch my 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 life or in the future what you're willing to do I tell you do not okay because these things are not something to play with. Oleh karena itu, aku kasih tahu boardnya biasanya kayak gini. Jadi dulu itu orang memba- memanggilkan roh. Nah, you ma- you, pasti kalian pada gini kan. Berarti kalau orang manggil roh itu dia ada roh yang bagus, ada ada roh yang jahat. Betul. Dan kebetulan dari dulu itu pas mereka pakai ini sebetulnya the real story di awalnya adalah mereka memakai board ini untuk ngobrol sama keluarga yang udah meninggal. So, di awalnya dipakai bukan sesuatu yang serem guys, to tell you the truth. The story, the history, sejarahnya kayak gitu. Bukan dipakai untuk sesuatu yang serem. Sebetulnya mereka pakai ini, ini ada namanya by the way, bahasa Inggrisnya. It's called the uh, nos, n- nonsense. 
apa gitu aku lupa lah pokoknya mereka pakai boardnya ini untuk manggil keluarga desis yang orang yang udah meninggal dia balik dan sebetulnya yang dia panggil roh ala bariknya itu tiba-tiba kalau mereka panggil rohnya balik kan ke dalam boardnya inilah istilahnya dan cara main boardnya ini very simple kamu kalau ada koin koinnya itu ditaruh di tengah dan orang di sekelilingnya di antara kamu mau ada dua orang tiga orang kayak empat orang kayak itu kalian harus taruh apa jarinya kalian di dalam koinnya ini sendiri disclaimer do not do this okay I'm just telling you know so taruh tangannya di dalam tengahnya itu and then koinnya itu ntar akan gerak sendiri dengan pertanyaan yang kita nanya jadi koinnya ini akan gerak sendiri dan jawab pertanyaan kita you might be saying kalau rohnya dipanggil dari keluarga kita tahu dari mana itu rohnya keluarga yang kita mau ngomong, mau ngomong sama dia well kebetulan orang Amerika dari zaman dulu itu pas rohnya datang to make sure it's one of the family spirits mereka nanya sesuatu yang orang lain tidak tahu jadi mereka nanya seperti kayak gini dulu waktu saya umur 7 tahun omnya saya dulu pernah let's say aku pernah jatuh lah digendong sama dia pernah jatuh aku dulu pernah ada kejadian dan ah- akhirnya spiritsnya itu akan jalanin koinnya untuk jawab kejadian apa and that way mereka tahu bahwa oh he's a, he's a part of the family yang balik adalah keluarga yang biasanya mereka nanya Siapa yang ada di dalam boardnya ini Dan mereka akan jawab tuh namanya mereka Dan akhir mereka kasih tahu namanya And akhirnya muncullah yang namanya salah satu orang dari keluarga And that's how the board was made Untuk orang yang zaman dulu yang nggak sempet ngomong sama orang yang udah meninggal Yang kangen atau apa Mereka menganggapnya seperti kayak gitu Sampai tahun 18 berapa gitu Jadi 10 tahun ke depannya atau 5 tahun ke depannya Dari yang pertama kali boardnya ini dibuat Kejadilah, kejadianlah yang namanya kejadian yang tidak enak. Jadi pas dipanggil, ada satu hari di mana rohnya ini, set hantunya ini, dia bohong. Jadi di, di, dia bohong. Jadi ada satu hari di mana pas lagi gerak-gerak kayak gini, pas ditanya, you know, gini, um, kamu uh, keluarganya aku, nama kamu siapa? Ditulislah nama keluarganya. Tapi kejadiannya waktu itu, by the way ini ada di koran Amerika dulu guys, ada di arsip Amerika. Jadi pertama kali yang kejadiannya ini yang tidak benar, and akhirnya boardnya itu di ban adalah hantunya yang masuk ke dalam boardnya ini dia bohong. I mean it doesn't take a genius for you to know yang namanya hantunya yang main yang yang masuk ke sini bisa bohong. I mean come on. I mean let, let me tell something. Kalau binatang bisa berubah pikiran, udah hantu juga udah pasti bisa berubah pikiran kan. Maksudnya kalau ditanya kayak who what's your name? Dia akan gini. Hmm, gua akan taruh nama keluarga aja nih supaya mereka agak baik-baik ke gue. Padahal dia jahat kan, roh yang jahat kan. Akhirnya itulah yang kejadian. Jadi ada satu hari ada empat orang lagi main. By the way, kalau nggak salah klipnya ini waktu aku baca sih beritanya itu it's an arsip. It's hard to get the 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 story guys. Tapi I got it. Jadi ada satu hari mereka lagi rekam ditaruh di YouTube. Literally ini anak ya. Dia berempat by the way. Jadi ada dua cowok, dua cewek. Dia lagi main. Literally ini anak ya. Pas dia nanya, dia bilang gini, oh it's my uncle, it's my deceased uncle. Akhirnya dia nanya lah uncle-nya. Jadi uh, 10 minutes through, through, the, through the session, mereka nanya banyak pertanyaan. Akhirnya koinnya gerak dengan jawabannya lah. Sampai satu kali pas ditanya, nggak tahu pertanyaan itu off. Jadi pas ditanya, ternyata dia nggak bisa jawab. Nggak tahu kenapa dia nggak bisa jawab. Akhirnya yang perempuan itu, ada by the way, waktu itu ada klipnya di Youtube. Tapi di band, di arsipnya itu juga nggak ada klipnya. Jadi pas dia nanya, ceweknya bilang, ini kayaknya bukan deh. Kayaknya kejadian itu beda katanya. And akhirnya guys, let me tell you, dari ceritanya ditulis adalah ini ceweknya langsung diangkat ke atas gitu. Jadi di dalam klip, waktu itu sih dia rekam untuk Youtube. Tapi I don't know where the clip is. Di, ceweknya kayak diangkat gitu pas lagi main, ceweknya diangkat terus ceweknya terbang on the other side of the room. And akhirnya pas kejadian ini, It, it was viral in America in the United States it was viral akhirnya akhirnya boardnya ini orang masih nggak percaya karena orang ngerasa gini empat oh, uh, anak muda terus tiba-tiba anak ceweknya satunya diangkat terus diterbangin they, 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 mereka pasti mikirin oh it's it's a prank you know they made it somehow mereka buat jadi it's nggak bener akhirnya mereka masih oke okay, oke okay aja sampai you guys won't believe me I'm about to finish with the Ouija board ready sampai satu hari Ouija board ini dijual di Toys R Us can you believe me or not you believe me or not if you go to Google right now right you open another tab you write yang namanya Ouija board believe Ouija board, they will give you 
a Hallmark. Do you guys know what hold on ya? Itu dari dari perusahaan Hallmark atau enggak? Pokoknya dijual. Jadi Ouija board ini dijual di Toys R Us. Jadi ada seberapa tahun itu you can just buy this off the shelf yang namanya boardnya ini. Karena they thought it was something really cool and they didn't believe it. And then sampai sekarang di sini masih banyak kejadian-kejadian yang rohnya enggak mau balik and akhirnya Ouija board ini di ban guys. Tapi to tell you the truth, banyak orang yang masih mainin yang namanya Ouija boardnya ini. Walaupun It's illegal currently di seluruh negara di mana-mana, tapi masih ada aja orang yang mainin yang mana Ouija boardnya ini. Total itu namanya Ouija. Nama bener kan? Ini. The makers of the first uh, talking board katanya as the board what they should call it. The name Ouija came th- merinding gue. Uh, the, the Ouija came through and when they asked what does it mean, the board replied good luck. It was the first person who actually made it and it really truly happened. Ouija itu namanya good luck. Tapi along the way banyak instant kejadian yang orang-orang tuh ngerasa takut banget. Jadi guys, okay, the second one, you ready? I don't want to say this name, guys. I literally don't want to say this name sebetulnya. Aku nggak mau sebut si namanya. Jadi kalian kalian baca aja ya dari screennya aku ya karena gua nggak mau ngomong sih karena ini it's in Indonesia kan. Jadi in Indonesia itu dari Amerika. Yang dari Indonesia adalah dia nih. Gue gak mau ngomong dia atau apa By the way Ini adalah folklore dari dulu Yang bener-bener banyak orang yang percaya Bahwa y- kalian bisa kaya dari dia Atau bisa minta apa aja dari dia Gue gak ngerti sih I, I have no idea why I call it dia I, It seems like a living person But it's not So what happens was Dari dulu adalah ada cerita Yang namanya ini Yang ada di screennya aku sekarang Right over here Kalau kalian bisa ngelihat Dulu ini Dia ada enchantingnya Jadi dia beda banget sama Ouija board Kalau ini ada enchantingnya ada kalimat yang bisa diomongin. Kalian pasti pernah dengar kalimatnya ini atau satu ka, ya satu kali eh satu kalimat enggak sih? Ada berapa kalimat lah? Ada berarti ka, kalam, kalim, jadi kalau kalian mau main yang namanya ini, mereka dulu itu orang yang dulu banget. Karena gini ya, mungkin menurut aku dari ceritanya karena I look up the research the story. Jadi dari dulu adalah banyak orang yang mau uang katanya, banyak orang yang butuh uang namanya, banyak orang yang pengen rich, pengen kaya dan lain sebagainya. So Ada satu, bukan satu hari sih, jadi dulu ini, ini seperti kayak satu game atau satu panggilan Dimana mereka bisa ngelakuin apa aja Contoh satu, bikin orang cinta sama orang lain Dua, bikin orang sakit Tiga, bikin orang kaya Empat, dia bisa ngomong Seperti kayak Wija, dia bisa ngomong sama yang namanya barangnya ini yang ada di screennya aku Ah man, itu serem banget just to let you know Oke, okay? so the story adalah dia punya kalimat Untuk kamu manggil dia, itu kalimatnya itu ada kalimatnya Sebetulnya I remember kalimatnya I just don't want to say it tonight Because tonight adalah uh, malam Jumat And I literally don't want to say it tonight guys So I just want to let you know But if you go Google, you should know kalimatnya By the way, if you see it, don't read it out Karena... Ya, aku nggak bilang bahaya sih. It's just that nggak enak aja disebutnya. Oke, okay? so ini pas udah dimasukin, biasanya ini bisa berdiri sendiri. Jadi kalau lihat di sini yang namanya patungnya, aku bilangnya patungnya, bonekanya lah. Bonekanya ini bisa berdiri sendiri, and akhirnya bonekanya itu bisa geter. Pas bonekanya geter, biasanya kamu nanya apa aja, bonekanya ini bisa jawab in the sense of suara atau nggak ditulis, ditulis di bawah. Jadi kamu biasanya taruh kertas sama taruh pensil. This really really happens. You guys know kan? Ini dibuat dari film juga. Ini ada film yang ini kan? You guys know? Ini filmnya juga based on a true story katanya. And konon katanya di filmnya itu pas mereka lagi shoot filmnya itu banyak kejadian-kejadian yang sangat-sangat aneh. By the way, ini masih sering dilakukan sama orang Indonesia just to let you know. Karena aku nggak mau sebut namanya, it's karena itu alasannya masih sering dilakukan sama orang Indonesia. And pas just to let you know, itu pasti dikasih gini ya. Karena gue takut banget Karena sering dilakukan Takut aku aku baca kalimatnya And akhirnya dia datang lah By accident lah gitu I, I really don't want to tell you the truth And a lot of my friend has played this Banyak teman aku udah pernah main uh, Gak tau deh kalian pernah denger nggak yang namanya ini nih Yang, yang satu ini ba- Banyak teman aku yang udah pernah main Banyak teman aku yang main itu Akhirnya mereka juga sampai sekarang Eee uh, Ya aku nggak mau cerita sih karena menurut aku kakaknya dia mungkin nonton live streamnya aku yang ini. Aku cuma mau bilang aja dulu ada teman aku yang main dan akhirnya pas sudah main selesai sampai sekarang pun dia jadi bukan biasa. Maksudnya anaknya itu uh, something is off. Mungkin aku mau bilang kayak gitu. Something is off about him. Jadi the way he speaks, the way itu dia main cuma sekali dan akhirnya seumur hidup dia jadi anak yang seperti kayak gitu. I just wanna let you know. Uh, I don't wanna say his name because I do know that. 
um, the whole family is a is a friend of mine and his brother is a good friend of mine and his brother is probably looking at this stream and I, do, I really don't want to ceritain mengenai itu karena it's, it has something to do with the family jadi gue gak mau gak mau ada kaitannya dengan itu and gue gak enak lah karena ada keluarga di sini ya so there is there, there is guys I mean this is like real this is true real okay the last one you ready the last one hits home for me do you know why because it's a Japanese board it hits home with me so the first one is an American the second one is Indonesian and the third one is a Japanese board and why it hits home with me because I played this I I okay I tell you first okay disclaimer I played this one and this one is close to the heart with me why you guys know that i used to live in japan right when i was in japan i went to a school nagoya international school now the name of the board is called kokurisan now that is the name of the board now it has an enchantment also i don't want to repeat it a couple of times <laughs> damn it i have no idea uh, anyway i just somehow i, I just heard a, a girl's voice just now on my headphone. I think bilangan or something. Anyway, okay, anyway, okay. I don't want to think about it. So this one is right after aku sebut namanya lagi. Okay, so I play this. Namanya kokurisan. Kokurisan ini juga ada enchantmentnya. Ada enchantmentnya. Ada ada kalimatnya. Kalimatnya. And kalimatnya itu aku pernah sebut. So dulu aku pernah main yang namanya ini. I let you know uh, main kokurisan itu seperti apa. This is very simple. And everyone is doing it. You go to YouTube and all the Indonesians also trying it out. They're testing it out also. I don't know how to play this. You just get a piece of paper, right? You get a piece of paper. And then you write from 0 to 10. So same, right? Deja vu for you. Seperti mirip seperti kayak yang namanya uh, Ouija board yang tadi. 0 sampai 10. And then you have to write the hiragana hir, hiragana text of Jap Japan. Yang A, I, U, E, O. You know, kakiku, keko, sasi. You have to write that all the way sampai N. Because the the alphabet in Japanese is a bit different. The numbers are the same, but the alphabet is a bit different. So you have to write akasatana all the way. Which is ayu eo, kakiku, keko, sasi, suseso, patitu, teto. And all of the, all the way. And then that's how they, that's how the... The ghost is called the ghost is called Kokurisan, and that's how he moved the the coin and answer your question. Now you're probably asking me how can you play this with um, with uh, alphabet? Yes, you can, but they say if you play with al alphabet, normally the spirits that come it's not from Japan. Normally it comes from your country. So Kokurisan is a very special board game which you can actually play alone. And when you can play al alone or you can play with two people, this is what happens. Okay, so after you draw the number and then you write down the hiragana. And there's always a high and a ye. High and ye means high means yes, and ye means no. And then in the middle, like my screen, in the middle, there's a tori gate, which is a gate which is red color. And normally this gate is in the middle of the paper. Why? Because it... I'm hearing very weird stuff. So the gate has a red color, right? And the red color gate, it represents something. It represents what? Yang merah itu represent adalah, jadi abis kamu cerita semuanya, ini kokurisan ini, waktu hantunya itu harus balik lagi pulang. Untuk balik lagi pulang, di, kamu harus suruh hantunya ini balik lagi ke tori gate-nya. Karena tori gate itu artinya gate of, uh, inilah, uh, separation. Istilahnya kamu kalau gate ini, simbolis bahwa dia harus pulang. So, let me start with my story. You ready? So when I was in Japan, when I was in interna international schools, Nagoya, when I was in, I think, SD class 6, la, I wasn't that big and I wasn't that small also, but I'm I'm, I'm well known with this game. And so one day, in uh, when I was, uh, it, it was in recess, guys, if you cannot sleep alone, don't listen to this one, okay? When I was in recess, I was out in recess. So my my field of recess of school, itu jauh, guys. Maksudnya, luas banget. Ada, ada baseball field, ada basketball field, juga ada playground, dan lain sebagainya. Nah, gurunya aku tuh dulu, dari dulu bilang kayak gini, jangan pergi ke field yang agak sedikit jauh, karena dia nggak bisa mantau, dan akhirnya nggak bisa guide. I think, you know me lah, I'm very naughty when I was little, right? So, jadi pas anak-anak SD kelas 6, 6 atau 5, waktu itu aku lupa, akhirnya teman aku tuh pergi, jadi sekurang teman aku, teman aku tuh ada 4 orang waktu itu pergi, semua cowok lah. Kita sampai di ujung, dan di ujung dari fieldnya itu ada pohon-pohon, jadi kita duduk di bawah pohon, karena lumayan cukup gerah, akhirnya kita duduk di situ, and akhirnya teman aku ngeluarin satu kertas, yang udah digambar guys, yang namanya high sama iye-nya, and the tori gate-nya 1 sampai 10, 0 sampai 10, dan akasa tanah and all of them. And teman aku keluarin dan dia bilang kayak gini because I was still young jadi I don't know what what this board game is kan akhirnya teman aku ngeluarin dia bilang gini hey guys let's hold this coin karena ini juga butuh coin guys so let's hold this coin akhirnya semua bikin uh, pegang koinnya ini kan 
Karena aku juga nggak tahu, jadi aku ikut-ikut aja. So disclaimer for all of you, just to let you know, kalau if your friend ask you to do something, don't always say yes, okay? Think about it first. So yang kejadian adalah here it is. Pas dia suruh pegang, aku pegang kan. Terus dia bilang gini sebelum kita main, dia bilang kayak gini. So by the way, after we do this, your life will change. Terus aku kayak, what do you mean my life will change? My life will not change. My life will be the same. Dia bilang after we do this, your life will change. So he puts his finger, his finger, one finger, one finger, and puts it in a coin, and everyone does so. And then I ask myself kayak, ah, this this is like some kind of spiritual stuff and I realize no right and then my friend says are you ready to do this so I said might as well because I don't believe it saya gak percaya I didn't believe it so I just said might as well let's do it so the stupid thing was I said yes and then the guy enchanted the verse verse-nya ini banyak di google guys jadi di google itu akan kasih tahu verse-nya except I don't want to tell you the, the verse ready so he enchanted the verse and then he says now everyone say it after me so the the system goes like this so once one person say it the rest are to say it together so when the No, everyone stays together and everyone stays quiet and silent because you need to give a couple of minutes for the spirit to come and grab your coin. So when he says it, it gave me a couple of one minute. I mean, I tell you what happened and I tell you what really what I felt, okay? When he said it, I don't know, believe it, you guys believe me or not, but when he said it, there was a burst of wind. Okay? Okay, I realized it was very cold, but it was on a very hot day. So it was, it was very strange, but I thought it was like, ya udahlah, mungkin cuma angin doang. So the guys, so the guy starts asking question. He goes, <coughs> he goes like this: "Kokuri san, uh, I want to know, will tomorrow rain?" So he started with a very easy questions first, right? And then he started to go, "Okay." Then, then the coin move. I looked at the coin. I tell you, no joke, guys, because I, I myself ask him, "This is a lie." Like I told my friend, "Kaya, you're pushing it," and my friend's like, "No, I'm not pushing it," and I'm lifting. And my friend was like, "Gak tekan," but my friend was like, "Lifting kayak gitu, lifting it." And I, did, I, I looked at the coin, right? I said to myself, "There's no way someone's pushing this. I, I, there's no way." And I also in my mind, aku kayak gini, "There's no way, apa ya? There's no way this thing is moving by itself. Also, there's no way. I don't believe it." And I read gerakan, and then it gerak tuh yes. And I said to myself, "Oh," and and I asked, I told all my friends, aku bilang kayak gini, "You guys are pushing it, right? It's not me. Let me tell you, stop pranking me." I told everyone, right? And, and this my kapa gini. No, it's not us. They're like that. Akhirnya orang bilang ini, kukurisan. Please balik lagi ke dalam tori gate nya yang merah. Akhirnya dia gerak lagi guys, koinnya ke tori gate yang merah. Karena dia harus balik lagi kan. Akhirnya orangnya nanya lagi. So long story very short. Kurang sebelis, kurang lebih 10 menit. Aku lupa lah. Pertanyaan itu ada ada seberapa? Yang aku ingat adalah teman aku nanya kayak. Uh, ujian berikutnya itu kayak gimana itu satu I have just the, don't judge us okay guys we were in SD jadi we like to know the the, 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 the test answers nomor dua teman aku nanya kayak uh, di antara kita berempat yang yang okay I don't want to tell you this but he really said it he goes yang mati duluan itu siapa tapi pas dia ngomong ada seberapa yang dia ngomong aku lupa guys jawabannya sebetulnya dia jawab semuanya just sebetulnya koinnya itu gerak jawab cuman it's just that terlalu lama di SD I couldn't remember So, long story very short. You ready? Here's what happened. At the end dari pertanyaan semuanya, teman aku bilang gini, kokurisan balik lagi ke tori gate-nya dan pulang. Jadi dia muter nih, dia muter ke tori gate-nya dan koinnya itu nggak mau nggak mau ke gate-nya guys. Enggak, eh, sumpah demi. Itu koinnya itu nggak mau ke gate-nya. Akhirnya koinnya itu muter ke no, dia muter ke yes, dia muter ke 8 dan dia muter ke angka 6. So aku lagi mikir kan apaan sih ini aku bilang gitu kan Akhirnya aku bilang ngomong lagi supaya dia balik And from that moment I started to believe guys This is no joke aku bilang kayak gitu Aku bilang sama teman aku You better let tell him to go back to the Tory Gate Terus dia bilang lagi Balik lagi ke Tory Gate Koinnya tuh gerak Cuman dia nggak mau balik lagi ke Tory Gate So I remember Karena I precisely remember Kejadian itu sangat serem banget Aku bilang kayak gini Oke okay, ask one more time Jadi abis 5 kali dia nggak mau balik Ke 6 kali Dia balik. I realize kenapa dia 6 kali dia balik ke Tory Gate. Karena dia udah lingkarin angka 6. Udah 2 kali guys. Dia udah lingkarin angka. Jadi dia pengen kita ngomongin suruh dia balik 6 kali. You guys know something kan? The, the number 6... It's it's not good. You guys know something right? The number 6 is not good right? It means it's either... Okay, I don't want to tell you this. But just look it up. Number 6 itu gak, gak baik banget. And akhirnya, akhirnya dia balik nih ke Tory Gate-nya nih. Udah balik ke Tory Gate-nya. Gak tau gimana... Koinnya itu pas mau dilepas, koinnya itu langsung lari ke angka 4. So, let me get this straight with you, okay? Dia melingkarin warna 6-nya, habis itu dia lari ke warna 4. Warna 4 in a Jap- in Japanese, it, it uh, itu di pronounce-nya shi. Shi itu in Japanese it means the dead, 
the deceased orang yang sudah mati it means dead terus semuanya kaget kan semuanya bilang gini akhirnya teman aku teriak I remember this dia bilang gini balik lagi ke Tory Gate-nya akhirnya dia balik lagi ke Tory Gate-nya gak tau gimana teman aku lepas koinnya kan nah sebetulnya itu koinnya itu harus dilepas bareng-bareng kita harus ngitung kayak satu dua tiga abis itu dilepas guys tapi teman aku udah ngelepas duluan kan jadi aku juga kaget aku juga ngelepas dong so that's okay udah balik ke kelasnya semuanya pada ngeliat-ngeliatan tuh karena gurunya pun nggak tahu kita lagi main kan akhirnya teman aku bilang kayak gini e, hopefully ya kita aman tonight dia bilang gitu hopefully kita aman no worries kan hopefully kita aman udah nggak tahu gimana I, we all came back home when we all came back home Tomorrow morning, my friend yang lead board game-nya itu nggak sekolah. Dia nggak datang. Akhirnya aku kaget kan. Terus gurunya nggak tahu gimana salah satu teman aku yang berempat itu kasih tahu gurunya. Gurunya akhirnya ketahuan. Akhirnya gue dipanggil di principal office. Salah lagi gitu kan. Datang ke principal office. Principal aku bilang kayak gini. So, I heard you play a game yesterday. And dia bilang gitu. Terus... Ya aku jujur dong Aku bilang Ya yeah, we played this game Yang namanya Kukurisan Dia bilang gitu Terus dia bilang gini Do you know it's a Japanese game It's so dangerous Even the adults doesn't play this game Dia bilang kayak gitu Why did you play this game Why did you say yes I said I didn't do it It was my friend who did it Dia bilang Yeah and now you know What happened to him right Dia gak datang ke sekolah So I said I have no idea where he went I have no idea what happened to him And I said What happened to him I asked him right Dia bilang gini We also don't know And we've been calling his parents And his parents says He doesn't want to go outside his room And then the guy doesn't want to Go to the school Long story very short. After three days, the guy came back to school. My friend. And when he came back to school, every, I was like, Hey, what's up? You know, how you doing? And everything else. And he had a poker face on. He didn't smile. He didn't laugh also. He just went up to me and said, Oh, hi. How are you? Long time no see. And I said, Okay, so the class finished. After the class, here's what happened. You ready? And I said, Dude, why didn't you come to school? It's been three days. What happened? Everything okay? And he goes like this. He turned around to me with a very very sad and a very weird face he turned around to me he goes like this the spirit hasn't gone away dia bilang gitu and I said what are you talking about dude it's been a long time four days ago no he goes no it hasn't gone away and I said how the hell do you know and he turned around he goes because I know and I said wait a minute how the hell do you know how, how would you know Tell me, how would you know? Why do you tell me like this, the spirit is still here? And he goes, well, when I came home that day, I, I opened my bag and I opened my books. And when he opened his books, guys, it says written inside the book, they're like, I'm still here. Di semua lembar, ada yang nulis, I'm still here, pakai bahasa Inggris. Dan tulisannya itu tulisan kayak orang cursive, orang 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 dewasa. Jadi pas dia ngelihat di semua lembarnya tulisannya I'm still here, I'm still here, I'm still here di seluruh buku tasnya dia guys. Let me tell you. And hari itu pas aku bilang show me the book, show me the notebook. And dia bilang I will bring it tomorrow. And I saw it with my own two eyes. I tell you no joke. And I tell you something, okay? I, aku udah ngelihat bukunya ini. You guys kalau nggak kuat, you guys leave the room now. Pas dikasih lihat bukunya, pas dibuka nih, tulisan itu bukan dari pensil guys. <laughs> tulisan itu bukan dari pensil, let me tell you. Tulisannya itu semuanya warna hitam sih, bukan dari pensil. Tapi Jadi pas aku ngeliat, pas aku geser kayak gini, ternyata nempel di tangannya aku. It's kayak abu gitu, kayak abu. Kayak abu ya orang yang, apa sih? Kayak orang mati yang dibakar dan abunya gitu, ngerti gak sih? Kayak areng gitu loh, tapi ini my just guess sih, mau aku Kayak areng, dia nulis di bukunya itu kayak areng Tulisannya gini, I'm still here In all of the pages dalam bukunya dia, tadinya pagesnya kosong, semuanya And I lift up the abu, right, it's still in my hand, I said What kind of pencil is this? I told him, right And then I came home, I went to talk to my mom, and my mom and dad came to school Every mom, jadi the four friends that I have all came back to school with their parents, and mereka bilang their parents says, okay, something really bad is happening to my son, and my son is not well, and my son doesn't want to go to school. What should we do? Because they know, because everyone knows we played it, guys. They know. Long story, very short. Just to let you know. After one month, my friend moved school. My friend moved school. The story was my friend moved school. In fact, everyone was asking for my friend and everyone asked the principal. The principal says, oh, he moved school. But looking at the principal's face and the teacher's face, I don't think so he moved school, guys. I think something happened to him that we really don't know. 
something truly happened to my friend that I really don't know sampai sekarang I don't know where he is and I don't know which school he went to and I just want to let you know this is one experience that I will never forget in my life and I remember the writing I will never forget about that writing in his book it was the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life anyway guys that's it about my story I don't want to talk anymore hey man I just wanted to I, I just Man, it's so scary. I just I want to I don't want to share this anymore. Just to let you know because thinking about it gives me the creeps, let me tell you. Guys, I just want to tell you thank you so much for being here for my three board games that you're not allowed to play. And uh, let me just read the let me just read the chat box here with everyone inside the room. Um I have cop uh, Okay, Jason says, "Okay, I uh, Florencia says, "I have popcorn, but I haven't cooked it." Katanya. <laughs> Florencia bilang, "Coach, don't tell me you tried this." Yes, I did. You know the story. Faris is here. Yo, I was there. Faris was in the phone right now. He's inside the uh, live chat box. Yes, Coach Blank. No, oh my God, how are you brave enough to play it? Ah, I played it. I never want to play again. Coach, oh my God, why do you keep saying there's a girl's voice? Because there was just now, truly no joke. Sumba in my headphone, I heard someone. There was a voice. Okay, Coach Blank. You also you also said that in your previous stream. Oh my God, I'm scared for you. Okay, anyway, Declan. Okay, thank you so much. You were scared for me. Mm, Declan is here. Hello, hi Declan. Hi. Katanya. Oh, how? Okay, so guy. Oh my God, yes. Uh, I'm an indigo. If there is a ghost. It feels cold and hot. You're right. You see. You know it, right? Uh, orang suka bilang kalau misalnya kamu ngerasa ada 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 sesuatu yang aneh, udah pasti rasanya dingin. You know it, right? And kalau orang ngerasa sesuatu yang aneh, udah pasti ras, rasanya dingin, nggak panas. Karena mereka tuh katanya hawanya dingin. Friendship begini. Hmm, I think if the ghost follows him, he will become really sick. Yeah, I think that's what happened to him because his face, yeah. Pas dia masuk ke sekolah, pas aku ketemu dia itu, dia kayak, he's not feeling very well, let me tell you, not feeling very well. Uh, that's what happened to my uncle, oh my goodness, something happened to your uncle, oh, I hope he's he's okay. Oh my goodness, okay, anyway guys, uh, that's my three stories of today, today, uh, dari cerita malam of today, guys, I want to say thank you for you guys for being here. I want to say hello to Florencia, Faris, uh, Declan, and Jason, who's been inside this room, and Darren also at the beginning, who's inside the room, I want to say, and Sharon also, I want to say thank you so much for coming inside my cerita malam, I really do appreciate it, guys, thank you so much. Before you leave, guys, can you please give me a like, it will really help the channel, it doesn't help me, it doesn't give me anything, but you know, if you can just give me a like, it really makes the channel very healthy. And thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. Guys, if you're here watching this at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, please remember to subscribe. If you're not haven't subscribed yet, go over there and click the subscribe. It's free. You don't have to pay anything. And at the same time, you get a lot of content from me. By the way, Thursday, uh, Tuesday and Thursday are Cerita Malam content. And uh, Monday, Wednesday, uh, Wednesday and uh, Friday are This Is Life and Idea Yes content for all of you guys. So uh, stay tuned for tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm going to have an Idea Yes. I'm going to invite someone here. You probably know him. You know, he's a very big guy. Guy, very brewokan. He trains. He's a trainer. Also, he's gonna be here tomorrow with me. He's gonna share his passion with you guys, and um, pretty much he's gonna let you know what he's currently doing. And he's got something really good coming up his sleeves because he's making something, and he has a hobby, and he like to share it with you guys. Guys, thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. You guys, take care. Remember, always stay happy, stay healthy, and remember to pray before you sleep. Guys, thanks so much for coming into the uh, live chat box and to the live stream. Appreciate it so much. Bye. You guys take care, okay? Have a good night. You guys take care. See you soon. Next Tuesday, it's gonna be another scary one, and Thursday, also another Shrita Malam. You guys take care. Bye! Thank you.